We often hear people claim they can't do sums because they don't have a head for figures, they're more artistically gifted, and vice versa as well. Popular psychology divides us into two categories, mathematicians and artists. This dichotomy is based on the assumption that we tend to think either with the left or with the right half of the brain. The left is responsible for logical and rational thinking, the right for creativity and emotions. Just like many others, this theory too originated from simplification and distortion of scientific research. While there's no doubt that functional differences exist between the two hemispheres, science does not accept the theory of the dominance of one half of the brain at the expense of the other. The accepted version is that both hemispheres are closely interlinked and always work in mutual symbiosis. There's a good example of this in verbal communication. In most people, the speech centre is located in the left, more rational half of the brain. But that hemisphere itself doesn't have a monopoly on processing language. Some very important aspects of communication, such as intonation, rhythm, stress and accent, are controlled by the right hemisphere. And the two hemispheres are interlinked in a similar way for other activities as well. The conviction that activities associated with rational thinking stem from one side of the brain and creative thinking from the other has certain dangers inherent in it. It might influence young people, for example, in their choices of future study or occupation. The brain, though, has amazing capacity for creating new connections and for reorganising itself. This enables us to keep on learning constantly and even to change the character of our interests. By using the proper approach, we can succeed in strengthening those centres of the brain which we've always thought of as our weak points. Let's not waste any chance to make use of our potential simply because of the myth that tells us that we don't have the right sort of mind for something. Thank you.